A warm welcome to Deakin Residential Services at the Geelong Waterfront Campus. My name is Marion and I am your General Manager. Today I will take you through a range of information to provide you with everything that you need to know about our Waterfront Campus. By the end of today you will be convinced that 2021 will be the year that you will call Waterfront Res your new home. Today I'm going to briefly talk about accommodation across all four of our campuses before specifically looking at what Waterfront has to offer. I will also provide you with lots of information on our community, inviting our residents themselves to talk to you about their experiences as well as touching on our off-campus housing service. Deakin Residential Services has accommodation across all of our four physical campuses, in Geelong at our Waterfront and Warm Ponds campus, in Melbourne at our Burwood campus and our beautiful campus down the coast at Warrnambool. We are extremely proud to be industry leaders in student accommodation and this is shown by the awards that we have won. We have been recognised internationally within the Australian and New Zealand accommodation industry and also at Deakin by being the recipients of Deakin's Vice Chancellor's Awards. But our most important measure of success comes from the feedback and information provided by our students and residents. Through our Student Experience Survey, we are very proud and happy to see that not only do our residents like living with us on campus, with 92% stating it was good or very good, they would also recommend living on res to other students. So what can you expect out of your new home in 2021 at the waterfront? Located in the heart of Geelong CBD and overlooking the stunning Western Beach, it is a place where you will feel connected, safe in a diverse community, and it is certainly the place where you will make lifelong friends. It is extremely convenient as you live within the campus precinct and all of Deakin's academic and support services are just metres from your door. You are also 400 metres from Geelong's main train station should you wish to make a trip into Melbourne or otherwise walking distance to restaurants, cafes, shops and everything you could want right on your doorstep. This is the place in 2021 where you will feel supported, not only through our residential programmes through the support of our residential leaders, campus life teams and operational teams. We also have strong connections with Deakin services as well as external support services that you may need during your time here. But don't just take it from me, let's hear from Jane, one of our residents on the benefit of living on res at the waterfront. My dream is to become a successful businesswoman. From the age of six, I would spend hours after school and on the weekends with my dad whilst he was running his business. As I grew up, I continued to be interested in all aspects of business. It is a practical course with lots of opportunities to gain real life experience and the most useful when seeking to pursue business endeavours. The possibilities created by a Bachelor of Commerce are endless and exciting. I chose to live on Deakin Waterfront because I was moving to Geelong for university and I wanted to experience life through a different lens and experience a whole new way of living. Living on residence has been extremely beneficial in opportunities for independent and also collaborative studying. I've spent hours in our study rooms with other residences from my course studying for assignments, teaching each other concepts and setting up our professional profiles. The location of Waterfront is incredible as it is in the centre of Geelong and close to the beaches and shops, creating a way for all of the residences to socialise and get together during their break. Brom College at our Geelong Waterfront campus comprises of Brom House and TNG House. TNG House is a postgraduate, mature age, off-campus facility in the CBD close to the hospital and is ideal for medical students undergoing placement or who need to be located in that area. It comprises of 33 studio apartments and also has a rooftop terrace and common room with laundry facilities. 
There are some key criteria for these studio apartments as they fall under the Australian Government National Rental Affordability Scheme, which provides housing to low income residents. They also operate under the Residential Tenancies Act, which is a legally binding lease agreement. The income limit is $51,938 in the 12 months prior to the start of your lease, so February 2020 to February 21, and is the income of the resident, not their parents, in order to be eligible. Brom House, built in 2018 in the heart of the Geelong CBD, overlooks Western Beach and the Bay and has arguably the best views in Geelong. There are 412 beds in total across 11 levels and consists of shared apartments of between five and nine residents. Providing you with a private lockable bedroom, shared bathroom facilities and a modern open plan shared kitchen dining living space, the apartments are open and airy with plenty of natural light and views of your surroundings. In addition to your own apartment's communal facilities, Brom House has a breathtaking recreational common room on level 11 that includes a theatre room, quiet space, large kitchen and outdoor rooftop terrace with barbecue. There is also a communal laundry, plenty of study spaces and a podium with additional barbecues for those summer evenings. We also have accommodation at our Warm Ponds campus in Geelong, and should you wish to be considered for this alternative Geelong location, you can indicate this during your application process. There are three established colleges at Warm Ponds that have had a long history of participating in sporting, academic and cultural competitions, and these are Alfred Deakin, Barton and Parks Colleges. We're extremely excited to open a new college in 2021 at Warm Ponds to join this wonderful community. And the new precinct will not only provide us with an additional 320 beds, common room and recreational facilities, it also includes a large town hall and a village green for all Warm Ponds residents to enjoy. There are different room types available at Warm Ponds. So for more specific information, please ensure you watch the Deacon Accommodation Warm Ponds presentation or check out our website for further information. No matter which campus, lease length or accommodation style you choose, you can rest assured your weekly accommodation fee is all inclusive as simplicity is really the key. There are no tricky contracts or sharing of bills to negotiate your way through, your utilities Wi-Fi via the Deacon network, furniture and even common area cleaning is taken care of. Our cleaning team will take care of the common kitchens, bathrooms and living areas. However, your own bedroom is is your own responsibility. And yes, we do do mid-year room inspections. 
In addition to all of this, there is an abundance of residential programming and events that are exclusive to you during your time on residences, and it has never been so affordable to live at Deakin Res Waterfront. As you're unable to visit us in person this year, we recommend that you check out our facilities and rooms via our 3D virtual tours. Here you are able to look through an actual apartment as well as some common spaces. It is important that you select accommodation that is right for you and that you can call home in 2021. The layout of your bedroom is not the only consideration that you may have. And to ensure we are catering to specific needs of individuals, we are delighted to offer specific living and learning environments that include designated single gender apartments, quiet apartments, postgraduate and mature age apartments. You can note these preferences on your application for our placements team to review. Our amazing team are here to help you whatever time of the day or night, and we have extensive support in place for all of our residents. None more important than our 24 seven reception and security team. So there is always a friendly face or person at the end of the phone, no matter when you need them. In addition to this, our fantastic campus life team with the support of our wonderful residential leaders are there to ensure you truly feel a part of our community through the range of events and engagement opportunities, but also being able to support you through times where you may be missing home or just need a friendly ear to listen. They also have access to a range of support services, both at Deakin and externally. As always, there are so many more people that work tirelessly behind the scenes and our operational teams that look after maintenance, finance, administrative functions, as well as myself, are really looking forward to assisting you during your time on residences. When I was in secondary school, I realised that I had a knack for drawing and wanted to take it seriously. So when I finished school, I took up a foundation class where I studied art. While I loved painting on canvases and sketching portraits, I realised that it wasn't really a good fit for me. Then I discovered architecture where I quickly fell in love with building things. The idea of designing something that complements one of our most basic needs just got me hooked. I would still be able to maintain the creative freedom and instead of on canvases, my artworks would be built. I was drawn to Deakin because of its location. Who would pass out of studying and living near the waterfront? Also because Deakin has a strong architecture program with a mixture of both conceptual and hands-on work, which I really love. Whenever I'm on campus, I'm almost always at the studio. But besides that, I also go to the computer labs a lot to use the onboard software like Photoshop and Rhino. I go to One Ponds frequently as well to play soccer on the artificial pitch. I chose to live on res because being the unpunctual person that I am, I wanted to live close to uni. I also wouldn't, wouldn't need to think about transportation when I could just walk to class. Living on res has made it easy to balance my studies with life because of all the activities that DRS plans. I enjoy going to DRS plan events because there's usually free food involved and getting to socialize with people on res is just a pleasant experience. In my spare time I like to go to the skate park and take the skateboard out for a spin. I also enjoy taking walks at the botanical gardens all by the waterfront. As we previously mentioned, Deacon Res Geelong delivers over 100 events and activities a year for our residents and we are very proud of the diverse range of programs available to ensure there truly is something for everyone. We focus on five main pillars when creating our program for the year. Our social and community pillar, which includes volunteering opportunities, blood drives, pay it forward initiatives, the Res Ball and Deacon sponsored events. Our health and wellbeing pillar, with items such as yoga, res sport, inter-college footy and netball. Our arts and culture pillar, which has res factor, movie nights, res theatre initiatives, music rooms and open mic nights. Our academic pillar, enabling peer support opportunities, study suppers and study spaces for your academic success and leadership through our residential leadership program. We encourage our residents to take part in as many of these as possible to get the most out of their time on residencies. However, it is totally up to you what you attend and how often you choose to get involved. Remembering this is about providing you the support that you need to succeed in your endeavours whilst living at university. 
We would love to hear from you if you have any ideas of things you would like to see happening on Res as well. So please drop us an email at any time. We will now watch a video about our community values of respect. Deakin's respect values guide the community expectations and standards for our on-campus residential student cohort. First introduced in 2016, all of our residents, our student leaders and our staff are committed to these respect values. Values which have been critical in building and maintaining our happy and healthy communities here at Deakin. Our respect values guide every aspect of the residential experience and this is demonstrated by a clear and consistent articulation of our values in all of our rules, policies and documents, through a core residential communication campaign, in the recruitment, training and ongoing mentoring of our volunteer student leaders, and through integration in all of our student programs, events, awards, and everything we do. Research shows that the most successful communities are those that share common values, because irrespective of an individual's background, they feel like they have something in common with one another. And so far, our own measurements examining the implementation of our respect values across DRS have uncovered a number of positive findings. I think the respect philosophy has helped me better understand the expectations of my role within Student Res and more importantly I think it's helped me to understand what we're about and who we are as a community. Our aim in future years is to continue to educate the new cohort of residents year on year, building on a positive culture already in existence at Deakin Residential Services. While coming to RES is an exciting time for everyone and a start of your journey at Deakin University, we also recognise that it is the start to many, many adventures to come and like to think of it as your launch pad to your future. Studies have proven that Deakin students who live on residences for part or all of their degree achieve higher grades on average than their peers. They're more likely to complete their degree due to the greater sense of belonging during their studies. And they also make better connections during university than peers, establishing lifelong professional networks whilst living on campus that can benefit them in their future. We also offer an off-campus accommodation service, which is called HouseMe. As we mentioned earlier, it is very important that you think about what is going to meet your needs in your accommodation. And whilst we're very sure we can meet those needs at Deacon Res, it is important that you look at other options if you feel that may be your preference. Some of our students find that they live on Res for the first couple of years and then they move to a more independent off-campus shared house living environment with friends that they met on campus. HouseMe is a free service only for Deakin students, so you may find vacant properties or shared houses with a variety of different styles available to suit different budgets. It is fully independent and Deakin does not manage the connection between you and the property landlord or agent, so it is up to you to go and inspect and to make some choices for yourself, including establishing additional costs that you may incur for utilities and Wi-Fi. There is a lot of information on the HouseMe website to ensure that you understand your rights and responsibilities as a tenant and what you can expect from your landlord. So if you find a property that you're interested in, please ensure you've reviewed the full website before making the right decision for you. So now it's time to really think about what is important to you. Is it the location as we are in the heart of Geelong and so close to everything our amazing city has to offer, as well as public transport if you'd like to explore further afield? Or is it that our costs are simple with one easy monthly payment that you know covers all of your living expenses, plus the added bonus of cleaning of common areas and a huge number of free activities? So all you need to think about is how much food you will need and any social activities you would like to budget for off campus. We've also talked about the variety of accommodation options available to you. I encourage you to look once again at the 3D tours and our website to re-familiarise yourself with all of the options and preferences you would like to provide in your application. 
we pride ourselves here at Deacon Res on being able to offer a place that you can call home. With swipe card access and 24 hour staff and security, it is safe, it is secure, and you have people here to support you 24 hours a day. What could be more important than not only feeling at home, but also knowing you have all of those people around you to look after you whilst being able to live an independent life. Hi, I'm Angus, and I'm studying a Bachelor of Business at Deakin Waterfront. Hi, I'm Riley, I'm studying Mechanical Engineering at Deakin Warren Ponds. Hi, I'm Lewis, I'm studying Exercise and Sports Science at Warren Ponds, and we're all a part of the 2020 RL team. You. <laughs> <laughs> what were you most nervous about coming to Res? Um, I would say not making friends. I was very scared that I wouldn't meet anyone or I'd struggle to make friends with those I was living with. Uh, I came knowing no one, but uh, I've got a massive group of friends now and I hang out with them pretty much every day. Were there activities that made you feel included on res? Yep. And what was the most memorable event that you attended this year? Um, yeah, absolutely. Literally everything that Deacon puts on is uh, inclusive for everyone. I remember on the first day, we'd all get together as a family, like in our little unit, and then we all moved up to a big grassed area and got to meet so many new first years that were in the same situation as us. And I just felt like instantly I was a part of uh, my college and yeah, my family um, at Deakin. Um, I really enjoyed res ball. I think everyone gets dressed up, everyone um, yeah, it's just a good fun time and everyone gets together and has a bit of fun. Have you made lifelong friends on Res? Absolutely. And when you come in you think, oh, oh I'm a small fish, big pond, I've only got a couple of people coming here from, from Warrnambool, pardon the pun with the ponds. <laughs> um, but yeah, one, as soon as you step in in your first couple of days, your orientation weeks, you've got friends from literally everywhere and you don't even think about where they come from. So there's definitely lifelong friends regardless of location background, anything like that. What advice would you give to someone thinking about coming to live on res? I'd say just do it. Just don't have any fears or anything. Like I had fears but I thought, you know, I'll just go for it. And that was that. It do was it. good. Yeah. Leave your door open. Um, you never know who you'll meet if you just leave your door open. It's like someone you might move in and if you have your door open you can say g'day, you might meet. You don't never know what happens so just leave your door open. Absolutely. And on, on top of that, be open minded. Come in, say, say g'day to everyone. Just be a part of like, say hello, do one thing that scares you every day. Just come in, open mind, you never know where you're going, where you'll learn, you know, achieve. Also, two minute noodles, it's probably Yeah, a get around the two minute noodles. <laughs> <laughs>《》for 2021 are open now and it is a simple web-based application process so why not jump online apply now and take just 10 minutes applying for your new home for 2021. It is great to get in early and not have to think about it for the rest of the year. There is no application fee and no bond required so you really have nothing to lose and everything to gain. Waterfront Residences is in high demand, so the earlier you get in your application, the more chance you have of securing your spot on res. If you have any questions throughout the application process, you can contact our team who will walk you through. There are some also some very handy hints available on our website. If you have any questions about anything you've heard today, contact our team who are here 24 hours a day, seven days a week. You can send us an email or give us a call. On behalf of my team, we look forward to not only seeing your application, but also welcoming you to your new home in 2021.